Hello everyone, this is Mr. Steve Steve, or oh, Stefan if you want to call us that, that's actually my name, and uh, today I am continuing with episode 7 of my lovely lovely series slash playthrough of Oblivion, in preparation for Skyrim, uh, the lovely anticipated game that I have not yet pre-ordered, because I am skint, or short on a lot of money. Uh, can you believe it's £130 or $150 to get the collector's edition? You get a map, a PVC dragon, and I don't know. I'll, I'll really like the art book, actually. I, I do like art. I do a lot of drawing, but I would I would pay the money for that, but I, I want to save up for a new computer. Oh, God, I didn't know that was there. I want to save up for a new computer. Um, my computer's good, but it... I don't. I like playing PC games more. Oh. Well, I'll remember you, Doomstone Dragon. Ooh, sexy. There's dragons in the next game, and um, you might know some naked as well. It's so you can run a lot faster. And I took a bath because you start smelling after a while. So if you haven't checked out my previous videos or Chris's, because I do a dual commentary channel type thing, and um, if that makes any sense, check out his videos. But this is my video. And he's camping at the moment, shitting in the wood. Z um, so you can, um, in the meantime, just check my uh, channel, my videos out. And you'll see where I'm up to. Uh, but I can give you a quick recap now. I am doing the main quest. Sorry about that. I'm moving my stand. My jimmied shoebox is a stand. Oh, God. Uh, okay. Day gone. Okay. Um... I'm basically where this is. I skipped out the journey because it's pretty boring. If you don't mind me saying. Dawn. Is it now? Welcome, brother. The Hello. Is late. Welcome. The master still. You may do not tarry. The time of preparation. Right. I have two options here. Kill them all. Arrow awaits within. Right. Kill them all, or follow their little plan. I am Hannah, good for you. Warden of the Shrine of Good Vega. for you. By following the path of God, just gonna finish me tea off and um, while this guy talks. You have earned a place. Blah, 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 blah. You have arrived at an opportune time. Oh God, when did I make that? That's really cool. That's never good. By the master himself. As a member of the Actually, order it's quite tasty. Everything you need will be provided for you from the master's bounty. He must be a rich Give me bastard. Your and put on this. Ah, you get you lose all your gold, and I always lose him when I play the game. This is a toughie, isn't it? This is a very large boner in my uh, pocket. That didn't make sense. Um, what to do? What to do? Oh, I don't want to play along with it. No. What? But I then. Oh, but you have my fellow American. Well, I'm actually English, but... You're not getting out you so easily, escape. you cheeky the bugger. But death. you do. I like the hoods. I like the hoods. It's it's stylish and it's red. Slash. It's purple. I don't know. I'm either colorblind, but I don't know. Let's get, let's get down to killing people. That's why I'm here. Healthy. Gotta be like the cat. Gotta be. Who's there? Um, friends of the Mythic Dawn. Oh, <gasps> oh. You weakling in the arm. Nah, shouldn't. Nah. Come on then, you cheeky bastard. Ooh. <laughs> that is brilliant. That is actually brilliant. I miss being a Bosma or a Wood Elf. I think, uh, <coughs> sorry, excuse me. I think it's a much better um, decision because you, you're quite small. You're not seen very easily, and then um, you can just you you're good at archery, so that's quite good. Um, yeah, I could no. Have I got a mythic dawn robe? 
I shall don the mythic robe hood. Mythic dawn robe. That's it. Right, I want to save. There's a prisoner down there. And I want to try and save it or she or whatever it is. I think it's an um, Argonian, so it's it's a, it's it be lizard ish. Oh, hello, Dagon, uh, and your forearms. All right, let's go. Let's. Oh, 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 and we're free. Hop. Did you? Okay, missed. Okay. You're missing a vital part of the male anatomy, Mr. Dagon. Oh, yes. Ah! What's happening? Don't, don't. Don't die, don't die. I'll, I'll keep you alive. Oh. I'm pretty poor at keeping people alive, aren't I? I had four gold, I wonder why you kept that. I'll have your leak. Oh, but I feel kind of bad at the moment. I feel kind of bad. Didn't keep them alive. But, I'll have that. The mysterious, mysterious Xarxes, if that's what it is. And your carrot. Oh! You've fallen apart, my friend. Lovely teeth. I've got to say, lovely teeth. Wow. You got your comeuppance in the end, Mythic Dawn, bitch. Right. Let's uh, skedaddle before more of them um, weird people turn up. How do I get out? I know there's an armory here, but I never seem to get in it. Oh god. Oh bejeebus. I guess I'm going out this way then. Living quarters, never good. You always find most enemies in the living quarters. Hmm. Shh, shh, shh. Gotta be quiet and stealthy like the cat. I need to upgrade my arrows. In fact my bow needs upgrading. Ah! I'm getting a crack shot now, aren't I? Look at that, straight in the art. Heart. Ah. Feels good. Who's there? Me. That should have been a headshot, but didn't I'll take my iron arrow back and me leak. Please don't get up. The match door might be breaking, but you're going to die. Ow. Acolytes must not know how to make themselves armorified. I'll have the apple anyway. Hmm. So yeah, anyone been keeping up with Gamescom? Brilliant games. Brilliant games I've been seeing. Uh, one of them was called War of the Roses, set in the Tudor times. Well... Pre Tudor time, like before the rule of King Henry, and um, I know all about it, but I'm not kind of focusing on. Oh, wow. I'm not meant to toot my own horn, but toot toot, toot toot. Ow. That was a fine shot. Oh. Anyway, uh, War of the Roads, it's kind of set in the 16th century type. And then um, it looks, it's like a Call of Duty style medieval game and um i would really like to play it i really want to play it now now that i'm like i can imagine all of it and like all of its splendid glory and stuff i don't know i think it'll just look very good um not going to lie if it's shit it's shit my game design would be much better hmm i think i'll say my game design that's a lot of people Come on then, you silly sausage. And you. 
Um, I reckon... Okay, you do not fear death. And I've lost my train of thought. Um, right. Okay, you're full of arrows, apparently. And you've got a silver spoon. Where am I going? Ah, oh, there. Um, I'm not going to tell you my game design because it's very hush -hush stuff. If I do become a game designer, I'm not going to let it go. I'm going to write it down. For Lord Dagon, yes. Uh, come back. He's a spellcaster. Or, shall I say, was a spellcaster. Okay, maybe he's a spellcaster a little bit longer. Ah, oh, you know what, sorry, I can't be asked. Stupid tation round little men who can't get up. Nah, that's just kind of like a sub-chamber where they worship them. Hmm. Armory. Ugh, I'll just exit, I can't be bothered. It takes too long to go through the cave and it's already 11 minutes in the video. Oh, okay. Prefer very hard locks because you can do them quicker. I'm still feeling quite cocky off. Um. Oh, bugger now. Fuck off. Pardon my French, sorry. Still feeling quite cocky off there, uh, breaking into Captain Sword's uh, chamber with um, one pick up, pick lock. Oh, 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 right. Ah, oh, right, wow, that was easy. Very easy. Yeah. Fortunately, I'm not going to get congratulated by that Argonian who I failed to protect. But hey ho, life goes on, and um, I'm probably not going to remember him in a long time. So. Mm. And that's my mic stand just dropping, or shall I say my shoebox. Mm. Right, let's see. Uh, lovely, um, lovely scenery, isn't it? Not foggy at all. Sarcasm! Are you going to come and talk to me? Thank Talos, you... Do you have the... Please tell me you have some good... Ah, good, yes, yes, very good. You've done an adequately good job. Like to see you do it, old man. Like to see you do it. Good evening, good evening sir. to you, my fear, my fellow blade, brother, sister, whatever you are. Then books will increase over time till it's all the way on the floor and such and such as. Ah, you're back. I told Geoffrey not Hello, to... Hello, Sean Bean. I can see you've had bad news. You didn't recover the amulet, did you? By the nine, such a thing is dangerous even to have. <laughs> not for me. Forgive me. You were right to bring it. But you'd better give it to me. Listen, Sunshine, I carried it around for, like, the day game time. I'm, I'm quite capable enough to carry it around. If it was cursed and it would drain me fatigue or drain my health and magic, I would give it to you straight away, but I could just hang on for it. And be very dangerous. I'll have to proceed carefully. In the meantime, you should speak to Joffrey. He was concerned about. Oh God, not this bloody mission! It's bloody awful. Bloody awful. This evil book was written by Mayrooms. It's not really a book. It's more of just pictures. I haven't. No, you're drinking ale. Now I've had enough of ale. Like how the chimney just doesn't go anywhere, and I wanted to go all these swords be bloody useful in my house. If I had a house, I hope Martin knows what he's doing with that. How do you even know he's got a book? He served with honor. Should have brought him his sword. Ah yes, I hope you can help. The gate guards have reported seeing strangers on the road. For I Let's uh, go and kill these uh, strangers, and then uh, probably end the video. For being a really top secret secure area, they leave the doors open quite a lot. You know what? I'll be nice and shut the door. Lovely. Kind of like a 
Chinese Roman styled building. It's quite nice, quite sexy. It's a lovely. So if you can't see anything, I can't see anything either. But you can hear what you're hearing. I can't hear anything either. What's here? Hysterectomy. That's something different. Wow. Um, let's not double in. Oh, hello, Mythic Dawn agent. I heard you, bitch. And you. Don't forget. You know what? You know what? Let's let's spice things up a bit. For for Talos and she. You do not fear death. Nice hair, uh, nice mace you have there. I do not fear death. I don't need to know, no, if I just kill you anyway. So you know. Let's, uh, let's, let's, let's go and uh, finish this quest off. Because I want some gold, and I don't think that gives us any gold. In fact, no, it didn't give us any gold. So I'm no further into me house hunt. I have got actually a house. I've explained this in a previous video. It's the Fighter's Stronghold and the Mage's Tower and the Vile Lair. Um, but I don't want to use them because it's kind of like cheating. It's not, it's not with the proper game. And I'm playing the vanilla style. Um... So yeah, it kind of not right, I don't think. Anyway, if, if you think it's right, just let us know. If it's not, then don't. Um, I don't really know what to say. Um, oh, I know where they are. I don't need to be told. I've played this game like 50 times. And that's no exaggeration. When I was living in Australia, I'll tell you a life story before I go. When I was living in Australia, because my family, uh, Stefan's family, Steve Steve, we're trying to move there, emigrate to Australia. Um, that's what I want. We uh, just packed up and went, got the visas and stuff. Um, visas so you can live in the country, basically. And um, let's wait till these guards go. And um, for six months, seven months, I literally played the pants off this game. Because when you're in Australia doing nothing, trying to like get settled, it's quite boring, so I would wake up at about 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock in the after in, um, afternoon. Wow, that would be uh, quite an adventure. But I would wake up quite uh, uh, early, get me breakfast, have a half an hour on Need for Speed or something, go on, oh, quite secret, go down to the beach, surf, bodyboard, whatever, and then I would come back about half five, I would say, and then um, I would play Oblivion till about two o'clock in the morning. So, you know, sounds good, doesn't it? No, it's bloody boring, bloody boring. But I know a lot about this game, so, yeah. I can um, do a lot of things on it. And there was no internet there, so I couldn't play with friends on like Modern Warfare, because Modern Warfare, there was no Modern Warfare 2. And uh, that was about it. <laughs> Unbelievably. Anyway, oh god, where am I? I can see that guardians are very well equipped. A rat and a mud crab, or two mud crabs. Wow. Well, this has been an exciting episode. Um. Oh, that was itchy. My nose was itchy. Not picking it, just itching it. Um. If you liked the video, I'm. Um, you can check out the other videos if you haven't got into this video because you don't understand what's happening. Just brought me to there again. Um, you can check on our channel. Um, Chris is obviously on camping this this weekend, so he won't be doing any videos. I will be doing most of the videos. Um, yeah. Uh, check back some, some more later. So, uh, please subscribe, rate, comment, blah 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 blah, blah stuff. Um, and yeah, uh, see you later. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.